three people were shot. A woman was injured, two men killed. Friends identifying the man as Javante Smart, better known as Smoke Dog, an up and coming hip hop artist. I'm Smoke Dog, I'm from Regent Park, and I make music to tell my story from where I'm from. And all the people that can't tell the story from where I'm from. Today, we'll be talking about Javante Smart, aka Smoke Dog, who was a 21 year old underground rap star from Toronto. We will be talking about how he started in the rap game, how he was coming up, and his tragic downfall. Let's get into the details. Smoke Dog grew up in Regent Park, one of the oldest public housing projects located in downtown Toronto. It is known to be one of the most dangerous neighborhoods across North America with a long history of gang violence. Smoke Dog has a total of eight siblings, six of which are not known publicly. His older sibling, Tanky the Truth, has found himself always getting into trouble. He was released on parole during the beginning of the COVID-19 lockdown, somewhere around the start of 2020, and headed back into jail by the end of 2020. He was arrested with 28 charges after he supposedly shot and killed a 12-year-old boy with a stray bullet in Toronto. His younger brother, a rapper who goes by the name of Young Smoke, started his rap career after his brother Smoke Dog passed away in order to continue his life. Legacy. He started his rap career appearing on Smoke Dog's post Thomas album Struggle Before Glory as a bonus track called Smokey's World. His debut music video for his song Days by the Raba comes six months after his brother's death. Here's a small clip for any of you who don't know Young Smoke. Came through dripping like a crack in the ceiling. I came through blessed like I just finna sneeze. On my best year, I know I won't leave. She go up and down like a lever. Number of times, make my seat hurt. I got bands in the beamer. She the one, all these drugs. I make love to my heater. Moving past his family life, let's get more into the music side of Smoke Dog. Smoke Dog was an active member of a music group known as the Halal Gang, along with artists such as Safe, Puffy Els, Mustafa the Poet, Young Smoke, and formerly Moji. Smoke Dog currently has over 100,000 monthly listeners on Spotify, even two and a half years after his passing, which are pretty impressive numbers for a Toronto underground rapper. He started his rap career back in 2012 with no intentions of doing it full time. He appeared in music videos alongside Brony, Sick People, YH, and Top Gunna. In late 2014, Smoke Dog started off going to the studio for fun with his peers, including his late friend Ano, who funded and organized video shoots and studio sessions. One day, Smoke Dog decided to give rap another shot, so he hopped on a track with Moji, which is now known as Still. In case you never heard the song Still, here's a short clip of it. Is you a light? We still by the plaza, still moving product, moving lava, not rocking product, rocking Gucci. I still slap it down on your bitch booty. And fill it up with batteries. Man down. That's the casualty. A few days after the song had dropped, people were going crazy in Toronto and picking up on the underground rap scene. It got to the point where Drake took to his Instagram and reposted a clip of the music video, giving co signs to both rappers. In late 2015, a leaked version of Still came out with UK rapper Giggs with an added verse. With Smoke Dog's newfound fame across the city, he released songs such as Trap House, his biggest single to date, and other songs like Canada Up and Overseas featuring Skepta, which got him further into the rap scene. His constant collaborations with rappers from Halal Gang and Esplanade, also known as Prime, built a name and brought publicity not only to him, but to his set and other artist friends. From 2015 and onwards, Smoke Dog has been consistent and been dropping hits back to back, leading him to fame across Canada. But it didn't stop there for Smoke Dog. After the release of Drake's 2017 album More Life, he invited rappers Smoke Dog and Pressa to a worldwide tour alongside him. It was going great for Smoke Dog. He was expanding his fan base to different parts of the world, and there was all also rumors that he had major record labels contacting him, but people were applauding for the worst. Smoke Dog reportedly had his chain snatched from him after a show he did. This is a music video from opposition rapper Casper TNG wearing Smoke Dog's stolen chain around his neck. Furthermore, to make matters worse, days after Smoke Dog broke news to his fans that he would be dropping his debut album in the upcoming months, he was shot and killed in broad daylight alongside his friend Koba Prime. It was during the evening of June 30th of 2018, where rumors claim him and another Toronto rapper known as 21 Neat got into an argument which ended up with two men dead. As soon as the gunman was identified, Toronto police deemed 21 Neat the most wanted in the city on two first degree murder charges. It wasn't until August August of 2019 where he was caught across the country in British Columbia and was taken into custody for the murders of Smoke Dog and Cobra Prime. Rumors did speculate that Smoke Dog was targeted after releasing a music video on the opposition territory, Alexander Park, also known as P.O. My niggas taking out witness, diamonds water they be dripping, get back tights like a Chris 
listening uh, Say smoke that broke, y'all tripping. y'all tripping You don't wanna go missing nah. We'll make you swim with the fishes, with the fishes. Drowning, drowning after the passing of Smoke Dog, the city was devastated and rappers such as Drake, Killy, and Nav paid respects to the deceased rapper. Smoke Dog's team managed to keep his legacy alive by releasing his debut album in November of 2018 called Struggle Before Glory and Struggle Before Glory Deluxe in June of 2020. The project featured artists such as Fredo, J. Critch, Giggs, A.G. Chasey, Safe, Puffy Ells, and French Montana. Smoke Dog's music is available on all stream platforms and links to his social media will be provided in the description section. And I want to say recipe Smoke Dog and condolences to his family. Thank you for watching the whole video. If you liked it, please subscribe, please like the video. Um, if you can drop me any like requests for future videos or even some feedback, I'd appreciate that. Thank you.